They start with Ohio State, which will be interesting. Chris Holtman, who was at Butler, he has taken his talents on that bench over to Ohio State, but then Florida is pretty stinking good. And then Stanford, if they can knock off Florida, it would be difficult because of Reed Travis, the power forward, down on the farm. And you see there Duke defeating Michigan State tonight by seven. And without Bagley, for the most part, after he injured his eye, he didn't play the rest of the game, is my understanding. So, shows you the depth that Duke has. Yeah, there's still a lot there. They got, they just keep, the rich keep getting richer when it comes to college basketball. Duke get, picks up Marvin Bagley Jr. As he reclassifies, they just got a commitment and then a signed letter of intent from R.J. Barrett, who's arguably the number one player in high school currently at Montverde Academy down in Florida, who's actually a high school teammate of somebody who signed with Gonzaga, Philippe Petrusev, a big man who's playing down there this season, 6'8". Gonzaga's staff is really high on that young man. That foul was called on Corey Kispert. This is Charles Williams at the line. And Charles makes them both. Kispert with the ball. Melson on the baseline. Skip and shot away no good. And the rebound and outlet. Here's Cole. Transition three on the way. Mm. Well, that's, that's a play that Corey shot. Kispert has never had to guard at the high school level. They stare you down three and transition by R.J. Cole. Norvell, Kispert. Williams. Jonathan so patient left hand away is good What poise and now he's got a thousand he's over right? a thousand Richard. <laughs> I told you he'd get it the sweeping hook across the middle Oh, it was a great play too Here's the leak Mingo now the shot is away by Williams and it's off and Norvell the weak side rebound Just tough shots from Williams now. 0 of 6. You don't need that look that early in the clock, Dan. No, not at all. Norvell, he can shoot it. That one's off. Cole again, watch him in transition. Right at Melson, right in. What a rebound by Williams, but Cole with great quickness in that paint. Boom. Kispert. Oh. That's the offensive foul. Cole and Marcus Hall in there. Kispert's a big boy. Well, that's a similar and three as to Kispert what I had talked about. Josh Perkins having his mind made up. That's a difficult third one to pick up in that first half. It'll be a learning experience, but that's one of the areas where Corey's going to have to improve over the course of the year, and I'm sure he will. His shooting ability and his ability to stretch the defense. We've talked about enough in two broadcasts now. Three, excuse me. But his ability to put the ball on the deck and quickly make decisions will improve. Cole. Getting a lot of attention right now down the baseline. Left it for Lewis. Short jumper is off. And that's a foul called there on number 10. Zion Cousins. A little shove to Jonathan Williams.